Hey guys, we're Time6. We're back watching Monk Season 1, Episode 10. This is called Mr. Monk Takes a Vacation. If you enjoy our videos, make sure to leave a like, comment down below your thoughts, and remember to subscribe for future uploads. You can also check out our Patreon page where you can watch the full uncut reactions. That's also where you can request your own episode or movie for us to watch. Link is going to be down below. Help support the channel by checking that out. This one was requested to us by RG on Patreon. Thank you for the request. And let's get started right away. I've been out here for what, 10 minutes? Because in a suit. What happened to the bathing suit I bought? Ooh, Sharona. Hey, look, I can see her room. Oh, not bad. Oh, he's going to see and, someone. And uh, there's Mr. Monk's room. Which one? What was that? Oh. Oh. Well, oh. Oh, it was a woman. That looks like, that looked like the... A waitress, I mean. The, uh, the maids. In, the maids, yeah. What are they called? In hotels. Uh, room service maids? I don't know. I've learned that I'm I'm more like monk than I thought like with organization. This guy's like tapping everything. Yeah. No, my Watch closet, uh, like every hanger has to be the same kind of hanger. Oh yeah. If I have a like out of store one, it's like ah. Shit. How do we know the boy just didn't make it up? Oh no, he's he's a good boy. He doesn't lie. All children lie, not him. What? That's so such a general thing to say. Uh oh. It's a water gun. Does it look real? Yeah, it looks like a dollar shirt. Right <laughs> what is he doing? You want me to go in backwards? <laughs> Who even is this? Right? I'm Rita Bronwyn, hotel security. This is Adrian Monk. He's assisting me. Where is your wife at the present moment? She drove into town to do some shopping. When did this oh. incident supposedly occur? About 15 minutes ago. <sighs> hmm. What did you find? Zilch. It was the cleanest room I've ever seen. Really? I'd stay there. Wow. <laughs> wow. Oh, that's yeah. a lot. Hey, just about to call your room. My Sharona. Oh my God, of course. This guy's cringe, bro. Oh no. He's talking to a woman. Can't see her face, but it's definitely not his yeah. wife. Yeah. Wife had like Angie. Different hair. Blonde hair. I'm in sixth grade. So can you read lips? I can barely read words. Really? At sixth grade? Oh, you're an idiot. Yeah. Dumbass, bro. <laughs> <For> re <laughs> Reading happens in grade one, yo. Right? <laughs> bro, my niece is three and she can. <laughs> bro. Benji, <laughs> dumbass. She can't just quit. Her boyfriend called from Buenos Aires. Oh. We have the Labor Day weekend around the corner. This guy is sus, bro. Oh, but someone quit? Quit now. But it's because you guys are going to take the hell just hold on. <laughs> Mr. Fenimore, I am 65 to 70% sure that you murdered your wife. Oh, wow. Just straight to it. Susan! Damn! <laughs> That's his wife, right? Yeah. 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 Monk is like, oh, shit. <laughs> Darling, Mr. Monk is a detective. Mm -hmm. He thinks I killed you in our suite this morning. <laughs> I think I'd remember. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it's someone all doing it in his room. So they, you know, yeah, he wasn't him. there, right? Yeah, he wasn't there. That's good. Is that a new one? Yeah, it's um, it's called Captain oh, Invisible. Nice. I like it. He can't okay. read, but he can draw. Hey, Sharona, what are you doing? Kids like 12 years old, can't fucking read. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you were just using your imagination like you do when you're drawing wow. comic books. I wasn't. Why won't you believe me? Because you can't read. There's no <laughs> it was a mistake, and that's a good thing because... Well, we're ripping this kid. <laughs> you have to, bro. No, no, He's no. 12 years old. I believe in a kid, man. Oh. Uh, yeah, what? what a lamp. Whoa. Ah, what could it be? Semen. Semen. Don't go on the bed. <laughs> <laughs> Wrinkled. Okay, here. <laughs> Try one of mine. Oh. His are like perfectly straight. Oh, yeah. Of course. Oh, his is crisp. Like new. Whoa. Oh. This one's glasses. The prescription. You'd think somebody would come looking for them. What? She was wearing glasses. Who? The, the woman you saw, the victim. Yeah. Like these? Uh oh. Oh my God. That's the guy. I saw that guy. Oh. On the beach today. <laughs> you know what he was wearing? The exact same thing. <laughs> okay, that was funny. <laughs> What's your name, sir? 
<laughs> oh shit. Oh no, don't tell oh, me the, the body. body. Oh, bro. What the fuck? That was so... that is oh, that's creepy as fuck. <laughs> I had a feeling. Bro. The glasses are there. They're gonna take it away. I think that was the idea. And you didn't get a good look. Uh, someone oh, removed sorry. that. Bro, this is something big, man. Who was man. there that like they're just keeping an eye, that an eye on? That kid. Um, the back fell off, and th there she was. What's well, gone? Ah, oh, fuck. Yo, shine the light in there. She was right there, Ma. I saw. Oh no! Shine the light. Shine the light. Oh wait, it was in a plastic bag. Who's fucking with this kid? This <laughs> kid. Calcium oxide. Oh. Lime. It's used to cover up smells. Oh. Smugglers use it to fool drug sniffing dogs. Oh. Really? You were wrong about Mr. Fenimore killing his wife. Oh, calcium oh. oxide. Oh. I think we're looking for a gang. No mm -hmm. way. All of the staff are in on it? All of the mates? It makes sense. It looks like some kind of good oh, mobster owned. Uh, they killed the other out. maid. And they got a raise out of it. Yeah. Oh. You think? Yo. That's it. A short gang. <laughs> Yo, you think it's them? It is. Well, Avencia, we were talking about her. She quit yesterday. Quit? She's dead. What's wrong? She never changed back into her street clothes. Ooh. Oh, no. It's too small. Oh, I see. Oh, yeah, that's so bait. It has a gap. Oh, shit. Oh, what the fuck? Financial documents. Mr. Monk. What are you doing here? Uh, we're lost. <laughs> it's probably downstairs. I told you downstairs, you gotta argue about every little thing. Chad, <laughs> can we get out of the bus, man? <laughs> <laughs> There's the locker. It's oh. Yo. With her clothes. No sé de lo que estás hablando. Oh. It was here. Oh, shit. The tile back on. The party's over. La fiesta está over. <laughs> no, I'm accusing you of murder. Damn, I like that. He didn't back down. Who's in a better position to steal information? Nobody gives the housekeeping staff a second thought. They're invisible. She grew a conscience and then wanted out. Whatever the reason, they had to get rid of her. Oh! Oh! oh. It was the cleanest crime Makes scene sense. in the history. Because no one's going to bother them, right? If the maids are cleaning the room. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Oh, yuck. Imagine. Now, it's checkout time, Mr. Monk. You are now officially trespassing in my hotel. <sighs> case but well, she's security. She'll allow it. Oh, I like this one. You could tell it's the first day. Oh. We were smiling. Wait, there's something there. It's a box. Drive carefully, Mr. Monk. Oh, no. this isn't over. Wow, so smug. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, they're evil. They're evil. Yeah. Evil. Come on. Literally a body in there. The kid saw it, so can't he just get more? Right. Oh. <laughs> of course. He's back. <laughs> <laughs> that little fucking says something. <laughs> The boxes? Oh, it's They're a thing. worried. It's a thing, bro. Oh, man. Three boxes. Four boxes. Which one is it? Let's try to guess. Let's try to guess. No, it's the, the new one That's on the, the ground. The colored one, that. Oh, no. I don't want to see that again. Wow. Damn. Look, I'm out of line there. Must be crazy. Yo, look at the confidence, though. <laughs> he has that you didn't even say a word. Uh, the vacation is supposed to be fun and relaxing. That was fun. <laughs> you seem upset. Has he paid Are you, you yet? You know what you need? Now shut up. Vacation. Shut up. All right. Alright, guys, thanks for watching the reaction portion of the video. Make sure to stay tuned for the discussion. If there's any part of the episode that we were able to keep in our YouTube edit, Click the link down below for the full uncut reaction and let's discuss now. This is called Monk Takes a Vacation. Always working, you know, even on the vacation. 
That's just like, you know. But if the murder never happened, like, I guess he would have relaxed. But. Yeah, like, what are the chances of a murder happening while monks there? You know, on vacation. <laughs> Dude, yeah, only because the kid got bored and she gave him a quarter to go. Literally. Because he wasn't allowed to jet ski. Yeah. Speaking of this kid, sixth grade, and he can't fucking read words. <laughs> I know he was being hyperbolic, but yeah, still. Yeah. Come on. Come Your on, brain man. Brain power is being Come utilized. Like, you should be able to write paragraphs at that point. He's, he's doing his own right, well, we were doing paragraphs in grade three, right? Yeah. That's when we got our first, like, provincial... Remember we had to write the stories, bro? No, we were writing yeah, zero we, stories. In, in grade three, you have your first provincial exam, right? The EQAO. Oh, whatever, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? So... Bruh, and that was like a test. We were writing, like... That speech. was a test test. Yeah. <laughs> this guy can't... You read one of the math one, yeah. Damn, Sharona. I don't know what to say. Maybe you got some other priorities. This is supposed to be uh, San Francisco, right? Yeah. I don't know, man. Anyways, that's not... At the end of the day, he saw murder, he was right, so... He was, yeah. He saw the body. <laughs> every time. <laughs> every single time. <laughs> Bro, he only saw it once. He saw it once. No, the, like, oh, right, yeah, the, the last one. Yeah. 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 It was the, the maids, like, they would have gone away with it. But like, the, mom got lucky so many times. Yeah, so lucky. Well, I, the I luckiest don't know. one was the arcade one where you found the, the glasses. glasses. No, honestly, I feel like the cops would have like in that city was it Miami? Mm. Wait, yeah. would have would have caught on, right? Because that person went missing. But right? the cops were no, they just said she quit. Yeah. Well, no, like her family's gonna be like, okay, she didn't come home. Where the fuck is she? And they're gonna have an investigation. If no one was looking for the body at that moment, they would have gone away with it one hundred percent. Probably, yeah. Even the the body is gone. Let's say they figure out where somewhere to hide it and no one finds it. Yeah. That's it. Person missing or not, who who did it? There's no cameras, you know? Yeah. You're right. Yeah. Should be cameras, I don't know why. Well, it's way back in the day, right? So Wow, they, they, they have a pretty team. tight crew. Pretty yeah, tight. Yeah, have gang. a security concierge that's like on point. So. Yeah, but they're running the joint. There's 180 un, uh, employees there that he said. Damn. Damn. No cameras, also, bro? Like, the shit that's going down in there must be crazy. 180 employees, bro? No it's a free for all. Right? 180. No camera, no security system. They're just fucking around. Just... No, I'm sure they have cameras in the important, like, public places. Like in the lobby and shit. Yeah. yeah. They have the cameras. They but they're not going to have it in the locker room. They know that. They're not going to have it in the rooms, right? The rooms, they have yeah. access to everything. Yeah, so like when you're in the room, it's easy to take a body out. You put it in the cart, yeah. take it out, right? Like no one's going to see anything. Yeah. Like having a ca not having a camera in the shed also, that's normal back in the day. Mm -hmm. Like nowadays you put cameras everywhere, right? But let's talk about what the fuck they were doing, yo. Rich business people were coming in and they were taking the info, yeah. yo. That's, I really like the motive. Yeah. The motive is really smart because it, it seems like it's totally logical. It's genius. You know, because they yeah. would have like documents and papers lying around. Now, for the mates to extrapolate that information and actually turn it into useful stock tips, that's a little bit, that's, that's a lot harder and you need like someone with like some level of financial expertise. But yeah, sure they exactly. have someone. They're just getting clearly, that information. Clearly, yeah. yeah. I think back in the days, they didn't have like shit on your phone, like apps and shit. It's just a pure papers, right? So you would, like, you would have someone, in, you, they, you would need someone, yeah. They could right. literally sell the information and then also make a profit from it. Oh, yeah. yeah. Like, oh, right. Right. Yeah, there's a lot of shit there, right? Uh, like fucking memos and shit. Like, oh, yeah. There's so true. much shit. Or you could like leverage it back against the company and be like, you know, settle with me or this goes public. Uh... That's so much. That's it's a dumb, riskier ball game. That's actually the dumbest thing. It's a do, riskier ball game. <laughs> no, that's very stupid. But regardless, uh, I mean, I like the maids. They're fun. That's probably the first one where fun the maids. killer was like actively taunting Monk as he's investigating. Like, I was like, bro, the fucking balls on these yeah. maids, yo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like they weren't even nervous. <laughs> Not until they, the end. Because there is before what. They probably, I, mean, I don't know. They seem so confident. They're a solid team, I think. They're just. I don't know if they've killed before, but I don't know. They were confident as fuck. Yeah. Oh, wait. What went missing last time? Jewelry, right? Yeah. So they probably stole something. Yeah. Oh, they stole stuff, for sure. It's a common thing when you go on vacation. 
you, you have like a safe where you have your own password or else you yeah. just kind of stole it. Yeah, that's exactly. You know? And it's like, how, who else would steal it, right? Nobody knows your fucking, nobody has a... Yeah, don't even keep safe. like change in your car, though. Like the valet person, bro, you can't trust any of that shit. Bruh, yeah. the valet, forget it. Yeah. Yeah, don't do the, everything. Like the, my car is my baby, so I won't even give it to valet. I, like my car's staying home. No, I'm gonna fucking take the, well, the I'm Uber. Gonna, yeah, why not? Valet all What's the, the point of valet anyways? Check, fuck. Check well, if you drive there. Right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Especially if you have like air, like here in Toronto, the airport parking is the worst. Like they have Oof. like the the park and park and fly. Mm. Yeah. Like, they are notorious for beating <laughs> up your car, stealing your shit, you name it. Cadillac converter taken. And in their like in the policy, it says. They're not liable for any damages or stolen goods whatsoever. That's bullshit because employees think defense, should be liable. They're not. But it's in their policy. You use huh. park and fly, your car is getting fucked up. Yeah, yeah, no, the only thing is not to use them, right? Because, but it's still stupid because, like, if it's just a parking lot, then fine. Yeah. But if you have a valet service, you have to hold some responsibility, you know? Oh, mm-hmm. my God. Because you have the person that you're employed dealing with the cars. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, I had this the other day, but with a hotel, and nothing happened to my car. They didn't steal anything. So. Oh, you gave it to Valley? Yeah. What did you have in there, anyways? There was huh? money in there. Oh. All right, guys, thanks for watching our reaction for episode 10 of Monk. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like, comment down below your thoughts, and remember to subscribe for future uploads, and we'll see you in the next video. Peace.